Well, hello my Facebook, Instagram followers, and my YouTube family everywhere. This is Jason Fitness Captain Music. I got other YouTube channels as well. How about Jason Cosmic RSSP Authority? RSSP, as I always say, it stands for Real Secret Space Program. But come on over to both channels, guys. I hope you'll subscribe. I hope you find that church bell, would you, and hit it so you can be notified for my future videos. Now, we're going to do a workout today, my friends. I'm going to attempt to do a shoulder and maybe even tricep workout for the back of the arms, which is three-quarters of the, the arms, right? For us guys, especially, we always want the showcase piece, the biceps, right? But triceps, and you ladies should know too, that's three quarters of the arm, right? So when your arm hangs straight down, what do you see? You should be seeing your triceps. And I've been somewhat neglecting them a little bit, particularly with this COVID virus. It's hard to get good workouts in. But I've got a lot of dumbbells now, more workout dumbbells. So we're going to do it. Um, and just look at this photo, my friends. We are going to live up to our universe potential, aren't we, guys? I hope so. So are you ready? I'm going to press pause. We're going to have a different background, and we're going to get started real soon, okay, guys? So hold your horses. Well, continuing on here, my friends. Again, this is Jason, Fitness Captain Music. As you can see, in my beautiful backyard in the powerful country of Canada. And we're gonna continue on with the workout, my friends. Shoulders and tries, okay? Hopefully we got enough time to do triceps. As I said, this is three quarters of your arm, guys, right? You know, us dudes, we always want the showcase, the biceps. But when your arm hangs straight down, what do you see? Well, you, it's your triceps, especially if they're toned. And a lot of ladies come up to me in the gym over the years and they say, well, Jason, you know, how do I tone up my triceps? And there's a lot of great exercises for that. We'll get into it in the future too, on future videos, my friends. But today I wanna to show you, first of all, shoulders, okay guys? Now, here's an, actually no, you know what? We will do triceps, pardon me. Let's do, here's an example of a great tricep extension exercise, my friends, and we'll do shoulders later. So you could do it standing, or you can do it seated. Seated would be like something like this. You're sitting down, elbows in tight to your, to your sides, to your face a little bit. Don't flare them out. And just extend nice and slow behind your head, straight up, flexing the tries. Just like that. And just keep it going. Always exhale on the contraction, breathe in on the stretch. I hope the camera angle is okay for you guys. We'll find out when, when this gets posted. So that's one way. Of course, you can go standing as well. Take an athletic stance, one leg forward, one right leg back, is how I like to do it. And then you're gonna go like this, again, elbows in fairly close to your sides, bending the elbows down for the stretch, straight up, flexing the tries at the top. So at the side, on the side, it's gonna look like that. This side, from behind, I should say. I hope that was okay. So that's how you do it and you feel great contraction, my friends. That's tricep extensions, overhead tricep extension. You can also do it with one dumbbell. I'll give you an example, hold on guys. Here we go. So it's the same idea. Again, I like to take an athletic stance, one leg forward, the right leg back. Some people will do, uh, they like to have their legs parallel when doing this exercise. But I again, I like to have one leg forward, one leg back, whatever you like to do. Again, same idea, my friends. You're gonna bend just from the elbow. Don't move your shoulders too much. Elbows in fairly close to your side, and then straight up. And have a nice stretch down below, and then straight up. Right up to the sky, flex those tries. Almost locking out your elbows, not quite. Just like that. Let's do the other side. You want to do about 10 to 12 repetitions, I would say, give or take. Ladies might want to do more like 15 reps, 12 to 15, okay? It all depends, but I like the 10 to 12 rep range, give or take, normally. My right side is a lot easier for me, stronger. I'm right-handed, naturally. So, if you go this angle, it looks like this. Front on, like this. You can also put your hand here for a spot if you want, my friends. 
Again, just bending from the elbow. Straight out. Feel that contraction. I'm feeling it. Just like that. That is an excellent exercise, my friends, to build up strength. You can build up some, some size in the triceps that way, and it really keeps them toned, okay? Now, we're gonna do a shoulder exercise, but I'm gonna press pause, and then I'm gonna move the camera, okay? So hold on, guys, hold on. Okay, now we're gonna do some shoulder presses, my friends, just like this, okay? Today, you know, I just want to give you guys an idea of some exercises you can do for your shoulders and tries, okay? And eventually we'll get in the gym again when those gyms open. And I'm telling you, my friends, I keep saying exercise. If you live that healthy, active lifestyle, you can beat any virus, my friends. And our bodies are designed to fight things like this. And yes, unfortunately, some people with pre-existing health conditions are dying. But my friends, overall most of us are gonna be okay, okay? And yes, let's continue to pray for other people in these dire truck times, okay? So anyway, let's sit down here, my friends. This is all to get stronger and feel better. Again, healthy. This is the shoulder press. So I like to go down to about ear level, my friends. If you go down too far like this, you're taking tension off your muscles, right? You probably maybe heard the odd trainer say that, hopefully. So you wanna go from about ear level, straight up, Almost locking your elbows, but not quite. Back down, and just feel that contraction. Just like that. And you could turn them in. Here's the Arnold press, they call it, because Arnold Schwarzenegger sort of invented this exercise. And then back up, turn them in, right in front of your chest, sort of in front of your chin too. That works all three heads of your delts, okay? If you want to do it this way, you'll feel it. It's a great exercise. Both of them are. Breathe in. Exhale at the top. Sometimes I mix it up. I'll go like this now. And just rep it out. Yeah. Whew. You want strong, sexy shoulders? Well, that's a great exercise to do, my friends. That's the shoulder press, okay? Again, depending on what your goals are, 10 to 12 rep range, Sometimes you might even want 15 reps. We have people walking around enjoying this beautiful day, and why not, okay? Now I'm gonna show you guys another exercise. Hopefully you can see me. Hopefully it's not too far. I'm gonna to attempt to do one arm lateral raises. I love doing that. You need to hold on to something because it's a, it's a real isolating, strict movement. It looks like this. So, in this case, my friends, you know what, that's too far for you guys probably to see accurately, right? So, let's say you grab onto something, okay? You're gonna stand with your feet close together, you grab on a pole or a tree, and you just go from here straight out to the sides. Well, you know what, I'm gonna go to the tree. I hope by the time you guys see this, you can see it okay on camera. So grabbing onto the tree in this case, not using any body momentum. Nice and slow, right about shoulder height, back down. Right away you'll feel that guys. Take a good weight. You won't be able to do very much weight though. It'll be lightweight, but you'll really feel it isolating those side delts. Yeah. Just like that. That's the idea. And then of course you'd switch arms. Hopefully you saw that, my friends. Let's pretend again. Pretend you're holding on to something, all right? Or do hold on to something, guys. In this case, I'm gonna to have to put the chair like this, okay? So the idea is, again, holding a pole, a tree, whatever. Your legs are close together, and just from here, dumbbells down at your sides. Here's a tip that most people don't know, my friends, but if you flex your lats, so I'm gonna go up to shoulder height, and from here, Keep your lats flexed, my friends, on the way down, okay? That protects your shoulder girdle, okay? So it's just like this. It's an excellent movement. You're gonna go about shoulder height, back down. So from the side, it's gonna look like this, my friends. So again, right down to your sides, my elbow's just a tiny bit bent. From there, straighten your arm right to your shoulder height. 
keep the elbow just slightly bent. Almost perfectly straight, but not quite. Exhale, inhale, and smile. I almost forgot to smile. That's the idea. Really feeling in those side of the shoulders. Now, if you go too high, like high like this, you're involving more of your traps. We want to keep the tension, my friends, on this exercise, particularly in that shoulder, okay? You know, we can work those traps later. So we want to go about right to about here, shoulder height, give or take, okay? And then you really feel it. So you can pause for one or two seconds if you want, like that. Just keep it going. Mind, body, muscle connection. Hold on, my friends. Now, so we just did, what did we do? We did tricep extensions, right? Two arms at a time, one arm at a time you can do as well, which really isolates, you know, when you do unilateral uh, movements like that. We did same thing with the shoulders, my friends. First, we did two arms at a time. You can also do one arm at a time, sitting down or standing. And we did one arm lateral raises. That's my favorite exercise for the side delts, my friends. Again, I love doing one arm at a time on those, okay? And hold on to something, brace yourself, and just, again, strict movement. You're not using any body English to get it up, okay? Now, to finish off today, my friends, this will be a brief workout video, but hopefully you guys enjoy it. Again, I hope you'll subscribe to my YouTube channel at Jason Fitness Captain Music, because that's where these videos will go, okay? And hopefully Facebook, too. So... And I hope you guys hit the church bell. Don't forget to get notified for my future videos. Now, let's do some shrugs. Looks like this, guys. So, grab a pair of fairly heavy dumbbells, okay, my friends? We are gonna work, again, the trapezius muscles right up here to keep the neck strong, okay, guys? We wanna keep these muscles all strong in here. I don't want to look like a football player. That's not my goal, guys. But nevertheless, you still want to have and work these traps maybe once a week. So here's an excellent exercise. You guys have probably seen a lot of dudes and even some ladies maybe doing this exercise, particularly guys. Women don't have to do this too much, but here we go. So we're going to take a shoulder width stance, knee slightly bent, athletic stance, right? Going to grab some heavy dumbbells that you could do, uh, you know, 8, 10, or 12 rep range again. And feel that just get a good muscle pump so it's gonna look like this this is a great finisher for your shoulders guys shrug the sh your your shoulder your shoulders right about to pretend you're like trying to touch your ears right so the sides is gonna look like this exhale your arms are almost completely straight and just feeling it in the traps and back down squeeze at the top so this side looks like this. Hi. Right. Front view, just like that. Keep the abs tight. Yeah. Feeling the traps there. Shrug up. Oh yeah. I'm pretty tired today. That's okay. Woo! Right away, my friends, you feel that right up here. It feels amazing. Actually, you know what? I lied, we'll do one more exercise, guys. Are you ready while well, we're on a roll? So you do that, my friends, do about 10 to 12 reps, two to three sets of each exercise. I almost forgot, my friends. Generally two, three, or four sets of each exercise, depending on how much energy you have. It's sort of depending on your fitness level. That's how many sets you want to do, okay? We were talking about rep ranges earlier, but. So now, uh, let's see here. I'll grab a set of 25s. I don't do these too often, but my buddy John, Muscle Stud Thunder John out in Burlington, him and his lovely wife. I know John, he likes to do this exercise a lot. So again, athletic stance. You can take a, a parallel stance. I prefer one leg forward, right leg back. And you're just gonna bring your dumbbells right forward, one at a time, to about eye level, okay? Well, just like this, eye level, bring it up. Right in front of your face. That's going to work the front of the shoulders, guys. Just like that. Howdy, guys. Yeah, you're on camera with the fitness captain. These guys work real hard doing physical labor. 
and I'm showing them that you could do some amazing exercises right here in the backyard. Hasta luego and hasta la vista, baby. And tengo un buen día. I just said, have a good day in Spanish. I hope it said it correctly. I think I did. So my friends, give those exercises a try. I'm so pumped being able to work out here. Now seeing these younger dudes know when I'm working out, they're energized. And they know, my friends, or they should know, that you can get a great body in your 20s and 30s. These guys are in their 20s. Piece of cake, right? They recover faster. That's, that's the real big difference, really, only when you get older, my friends. Is the main difference, I should say, is it just takes longer to recover sometimes when you get older, right? So rest is important, eating healthy, and really any age, that this is important, guys, but particularly as you get a bit older, right? But I always say, if you put your investment in your body, my friends, okay, and it always affects the mind too, but when you put your investment in your body over time, Father Time will not betray you. You got to be consistent though, my friends. Let's live that healthy, active lifestyle, okay? Now you don't have to lift weights like we did today, but weightlifting is excellent to sculpt your body, my friends. Again, make you, makes you feel great. Uh, it's great for your bone health. And you know, and do some walking, guys. Do it, do cycling, swimming, whatever it is. Do it, enjoy it, be active, guys, and uh, try to inspire others to the best of your ability, okay, my friends? That's what it's all about, right? These guys are inspired. I'm trying to inspire them. Seeing They're seeing this, this somewhat older, mature fitness captain working out, doing his best to show you guys, demonstrate some great exercises today, okay? Anyway, I think I've said enough. So give these exercises a try, my friends. And uh, more exercise workouts to come, I promise. We're gonna do some more bicep working out, okay? And, uh, I gotta go lift my, or I gotta lift these weights and bring them back to my home now, my friends. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for listening. I hope you subscribe. Give me the thumbs up. Hopefully, maybe you'll want to share my videos. And uh, yeah, give me the thumbs up because it's good for the the algorithms. If you enjoy my videos, that is okay, guys. And I hope I've inspired perhaps some people out there to live that healthy, active lifestyle and to feel good about yourself. And let's help one another through this crisis, my friends. And to do it, one of the ways is to work on our health. Let's talk about health and fitness and other topics and issues and, and enjoy life, okay? Take care, guys. And another motto I always like to say at times is that we all work out to satisfy the deep inner growl of our own vanity to some degree, right? But if you want your body not only to look great, but to function a superior way as well, then I'm the right man for the job. Your fitness captain, personal trainer's gotta go. Have a great day, everybody. Live strong, live healthy. See ya.